Hey guys, and welcome back to Story of Seasons. So, I was right in that Soul Country lied to us. It wasn't on the calendar, but they showed up on the 18th, which in the game is my character's birthday. Because my birthday is on the 18th of July, which is in summer, so there you go. But yeah, I wanted to go... I wanted Soul Country to show up so that we could ship everything that we needed to ship. Which I already took care of. Um, so we actually have a good bit of money, as you can see down on the bottom screen. So we are going to buy a blueprint today. We are going to buy the Seed Maker. Which is quite exciting. And I'm pretty sure we have everything we need to build it. So we are going to just basically go do that. Apparently we got a free book for that, which is so surprising. I wonder if anybody even knows that it's my birthday. Probably not. Oh! Well, Maurice knew. Thanks, buddy. Does Rieger know? Rieger, give me a present. Do you know how much seaweed I've given you? Like, three seaweeds? Rude. Fine. I wonder if I got any letters today. I don't think I did. That's pretty shitty. Nobody remembered my birthday. No one sent me anything for my birthday. That is just rude. I am very upset. Okay, so we can build the seed maker now. I'm pretty sure we have all the materials that we need. Here we go. Come here. Yep. Uh, because luckily someone told me to save turnip seeds for this. So I did. So we are good. And I've been saving you know, bricks and stuff that I found in the rivers. So, we are good to go. We're gonna build one of these guys. No idea how to use it, but we're gonna build it. Yo, I heard you were building a seed maker, so I came by to lend a hand. Who told you this? Who- do you have someone following me? I don't appreciate it. Okay, let's get to work. I'll give you some pointers as we go, so do like I tell you, okay? Okay. Okay, throw the turnip seeds. <laughs> this is architecture. This is just... This is how you do it. Don't worry, I got a hammer. I got this. He's like, yeah. Yeah. I really don't think I'm qualified to build this. Just saying. I feel like this is a hazard. I am endangering not only myself, but everyone around me. Good job, that's a fine piece of work you've done. Look at my eyebrows. Alright, bye. Alright. Aw, it looks like a little plant. That's cute. Where the crap did it go? Alright, well, that didn't take very long. Alright, where is it? Seed maker- What? Why is there a tree, like, right in front of my freaking barn? What the crap? Tree? That was not there yesterday. I don't think trees just appear, by the way. Goddamn tree. Just wait till I upgrade my axe and I cut you down. Where is the seed maker? Is it over here? Somewhere? Huh, there's a peach tree. I don't think we can get peaches right now. Oh, I can't even find the damn thing. Is it like on her property or something? Her crops are looking bad. Am I really going to have to Google this? Oh my gosh. I actually have to, like, find a place for it on the farm, which is fine, but why didn't it just, like, say that? It, like, put it in my inventory somehow. Like, I don't understand. Oh, it would fit there. <laughs> this looks ridiculous. Can I just say... 
Oh, I can only put it where it's blue, I guess. Well. I don't know how I'm going to fit everything I want to fit here. I guess I'll have to cut down some trees. Uh, for now, it's just going to go here, I guess. What? Ugh. No. Here. There we go. It needs to be facing this way. That is so bizarre. Well, at least we have it now. Of course, I have no idea what to do with it. But we have it. And that is what counts. Right? No. Let's go inside. See what we can do. Alright, we got this doohickey. This makes poop. Oh. Oh. Okay. So we have, like, recipes, kind of. What? Rose seduction? You're gonna tell me that that's fertilizer. I don't think that's what it is. That looks like perfume. Okay. Well, we're gonna make some fertilizer with some weeds. Whoop. Is this- Is this in-game time, or is this real time? Take out completed item. Oh, I think it's in-game time, because it said, like, three minutes. And that was definitely not three minutes of real time. Let's see. <gasps> A homeworld gem! Alright. What? Where did it go? Okay, so I guess I just made fertilizer. Okay. Anyway, that's why um, somebody told me to keep any of the weeds you found instead of selling them, because you can make fertilizer with them. Okay, what's this? Crop dryer. It's a machine that makes it easier to remove seeds from crops. Dried turnip. Golden. I want the golden turnip, man. Dried everything. Okay. And this is the threshing machine. <laughs> that sounds very dangerous and very scary. It's a machine that removes seeds from dried crops. And we don't have any dried crops. Okay. And then this is, I don't know what. And we have items that we can take out. Cool. Don't really have anything of interest, I guess. Um, so I'm gonna have to do a little bit of research and figure out, like, what to actually do with this, besides, you know, making fertilizer. Also, my 3DS is going to die. Save, 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 save. Save. Where is the cord? It is gone. Here's one. Ah, quickly. Oh, this is awkward to record, but what can you do? It's my stupid fault for not making sure it was charged before I started recording. Okay, so we got that. I also think that the new place is going to show up soon at the trading depot because I think we sold enough stuff. Which is pretty freaking sweet. I don't know for sure, but I think you had to sell like over a hundred thousand. Oh, today's the livestock expo. A public field has become available. Okay, it's the Cluck Cluck Festival. We don't have a chicken. I guess we could still go and talk to people. You just be like, hey, hey, Rieger. Okay, so country has been resocked. Blah 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 blah. Thank you for that. Hey, cow. Get your stupid ass back in there. Get... D Sir? Get in there. It always says that the cows look mangy even though I brush them. I don't understand. Am I not brushing them long enough? Like, what is their problem? Brush it, damn cow. I feel like that was long enough. I feel like I actually hurt the cow by brushing it that long. Also, this tree is going to piss me off so bad. Like, for the rest of forever. Because I can't upgrade my axe yet. Which is a huge pain. Yay, tomatoes! Look at all these tomatoes. That's the nice thing about tomatoes. They just keep regrowing. So, it's pretty low maintenance. I think I've only been putting fertilizer on this, like, top left crop. Because someone said to, like, only really use it for, like... Only kind of use the fertilizer on the one and then, like do something with the seed maker and make it better or something. I don't know yet. 
and get out the fertilizer. Wow! Oh, I guess I can put some on the tree too. Tree, would you like some? Have some fertilizer. I did get peaches the one day. You guys didn't see though, because I was like messing around off camera and doing boring stuff. So you didn't get to see that. But I will show what the peaches look like. It's really not that interesting, but I wonder if I can like plant them for another peach tree. I don't know. There's really no point in doing that right now because they only bloom in summer, I'm pretty sure. So by the time it would grow, it would not really be useful. But, oh, and we have onions today too. Man, we are going to make some money. Um, so I have been thinking, put away the watering can in my butt. I've been thinking that for like the end of this series, which is not going to come for a while, but I'm just putting it out there that eventually there will be an end to the series. But I was kind of thinking uh, of doing like maybe a montage uh, of like the best moments from the series because it's so long and you guys have kind of stuck with it or at least a lot of you have considering that it's still getting views um usually like a new episode hits like a hundred views at least within a couple days which is really awesome I'm glad that you guys are sticking with it and just being so supportive like you guys are great. You're always giving like super nice comments and I read all of them and I try to respond to all of them even when Google is being stupid and won't let me. But um, I was kind of thinking that maybe you guys could give me some of your ideas of what your favorite moments in the series are. Just like stuff that made you laugh or just entertaining moments or you know whatever. And then I could kind of put in some of your favorite moments in there as well because I love doing montages because they're just super fun and I feel like that would be kind of awesome for this series so yeah if you guys just want to kind of comment or message me or tweet me or whatever and just let me know like which moments from the series you really really enjoyed also I was thinking about creating a Facebook page for myself and the channel because right now I don't have one a few people have asked me if I had one. It might be easier for you guys to stay current with my videos when they get uploaded. I do have it connected to Twitter, so whenever I upload a video, it automatically posts to Twitter. So if any of you follow me on Twitter, then you will know that. Or if you are on Twitter, you can go follow me if you like. But um, I know that a lot of people are still into using Facebook, so I didn't know if that would be something that you would be interested in or not. And if so, please let me know. Also, I had a comment about, um, in the last video I was talking about possible series that I might do in the future, and I believe it was one of my UK followers, actually, which is really cool that, you know, people that are outside of America, you know, watch and all that stuff, but she was interested in seeing Animal Crossing, the Happy Home Designer, and I think I'm gonna do that, actually. I... I think I'm going to order the game today. My Best Buy certificate just came in, so I have like $5 of credit that I can use. Plus, because I'm a game member, I forget what it's called, and for Best Buy I get 20% off, so it'll make the game nice and cheap for me, which is always great because I do not get paid to do this. <laughs> I wish I did, but I don't. So anytime I can save a little bit of money on a game is awesome, especially because even if I one day could make money from this, I highly doubt I'll be able to make money from any kind of Nintendo content just because Nintendo is pretty strict with their policies and like they basically copyright the hell out of everything, which is really super annoying because it's like, dude, I'm, you know, advertising your game. Like people are buying your game because they're seeing me play it. So I've always been kind of irritated with Nintendo about that. Well, I don't have a grown animal prepared, so you can bite me. Can I still watch? Ah, your butt. But I think Sony and Microsoft are a lot better with that. It sucks because I would love to play, you know, Zelda or, you know, Mario Party or something like that. Which, I mean, I still might do, like, short episodes. But to do an entire series, especially one really long like this, it just would not... It would just suck because if I ever did want to monetize it, I would not be able to if, you know, they put copyright claims all over it, which they would because that's just what happens. Anyway, I think I'm going to buy Animal Crossing 
a happy home designer. I love Animal Crossing. So much fun. I really do want to play New Leaf on this channel, but again, I don't know about the copyright. Maybe we'll do that sometime, see how it goes, but I'm not really thinking about New Leaf at the moment because there are other games that I'm going to be playing first. I definitely want to do at least a couple episodes of Happy Home Designer so you guys can kind of see what it's all about. And I'm interested in the game myself, so you can look for that pretty soon. The game comes out on the 25th. I don't know if I'll have an episode up that early because I'm actually leaving for Disney on the 18th, which is when this video is going up. So I am probably on my way to Disney World right now. And Universal, we're going to Harry Potter World, which is amazing. And I absolutely cannot wait. Yeah, sorry we couldn't go to the Livestock Expo, but we don't have a chicken, and I guess we can't really do anything with that. So, we're just going to have to wait, and hopefully Soul Country will be there um, tomorrow. Today. Oh. Yes, I was right. Okay, new merchant arrives. Before we go into this, I really want to finish my thought. Um. Anyway, so, yeah, so I'm going to be going to Disney, so we're going to be getting back next weekend so like on saturday and i think the game comes out next friday i think that's the 25th but anyway so i i obviously won't have an episode up like right when it comes out but hopefully i'll have it out within that week so you guys can see it because i think there is some interest the other thing i was going to say is i actually managed to get windows 98 onto my computer which is pretty awesome because i've been dying to play some old pc games because i loved them and grew up with them so if there are any old PC games that you would like to see me play anything, like I actually got a stack of old Barbie games from the flea market not too long ago. I think it's going to be hilarious to play through because some of them I had as a kid and I think you guys are going to like that. So there's that. There's like tons of other old PC games that I loved, like the Disney games and like Harry Potter and all that stuff. So if you have any that you remember fondly or that you just think would be a riot for me to play, just comment and let me know. Okay, so, a new merchant. Finally, 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 finally. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> a good morning. We've got some really great news for you. Thanks to the tireless effort you and the other farmers have put in, we have another country interested in trading with us. Yeah, is it China? Miss Marielle, if you would come forward, please. <laughs> Marielle? What is up with her eyes? They're staring into my soul. Wow, so you're really Kita? So cool! I'm Marielle from Cabin Country, and I'm so glad to meet ya. I'll be coming into town to trade from now on, and I'd love it if you stopped by and visited my shop. Don't think too hard, just do it! Shia LaBeouf, just do it! Okay, I'm convinced. I'm gonna go. You can check your calendar to see which days Miss Marielle will be in town. Well then, if you would please excuse us. Bye! Another country's here to trade. I wonder what kind of things they brought. I can hardly wait to find out, and apparently I'm singing this. I hope they're there today. I'm going to be really irritated. <laughs> it's like, hey, come check out my stuff. But we're not freaking there today. So, which I don't think they are. Which is bullshit. <sighs> and Veronica's birthday. Okay, well, supposedly they're going to be there Wednesday. But yeah, so I think what I'm going to do is end this episode here. And then we can start on Wednesday in-game when Cabin Country is finally here. So we can see all the cool stuff that they have and hopefully buy a ton of it. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and supporting this series. Please break the hell out of that like button if you enjoyed this video. And I will see you in the next one.